Hi, Brentek here, where tech is made simple. So about a week ago, I'll let you know that it seems that not everyone was agreeing with Microsoft CEO Satya Nadella's recent comments about the company's mindset for 2026, all being about AR. And as I titled the video, which will be linked down below and in the end screen, Microsoft's AR obsession just backfired because people are starting to call Microsoft micro slop. Check the video out for more information. Now on this channel, we feature an app which I post about from time to time called FlyOB. And it seems now that the developer of FlyOB, Beelum, has now also caught on to this and has actually now started rolling out an app called Winslop. And I'll leave the download link and page in the description where you can get it over on GitHub. But I've downloaded the app prior to posting just to check it out. And you just download the app, you extract all, and you just click on the EXE afterwards, and there we go, there's Winslop. Now, Beelum, the developer, has said that such an Adela said, quoting, we need to get beyond the arguments of slop versus sophistication. And in case you're unaware, slop describes unnecessary low-value system components that are added by default consume resources and reduce user control without providing meaningful benefit. That's basically a definition according to the developer. Now, Bilem says that this app started as a joke. Then Microsoft said, slop versus sophistication out loud and it stopped being one. If this tool needs marketing, it probably shouldn't exist. That's according to the developer. Now, to be clear, Bilem says that Windows is not bad. He says he actually likes it. But the direction of Windows 11 is, with all the AR slop being pushed into Windows 11, especially on Copilot Plus PCs. So basically, you can click on Expect System. It'll give you the options. You toggle on or off what you want to be removed or not. And you click on Apply Selected Changes. You've also got apps you can inspect system and you've got some extensions. Yeah, you've got Chris Titus app. You can run that as well. And that Chris Titus app is, as an extension is also available in FlyOB. And yeah, you can toggle all, undo last changes, load additional slop feeds and so on. And this is the initial release version 0.25.11. As mentioned, you can get it over on GitHub. I'll leave the link in the description. Now, the developer says that Winslop does exactly what the name suggests. Number one, it removes slop. Number two, it reduces slop. Number three, it makes slop visible. And number four, it gives control back to the user. And under the hood, apparently it's a very small app, which I do agree with. It's very small. And just on a side note, before we end this video, this app Winslop isn't developed by Microsoft. So you should just proceed carefully when modifying core system components. But the fact that an app like this has been developed, as I mentioned in the Winslop video, does indicate that users are starting to suffer from AR fatigue. So if you are suffering from AR fatigue, then Winslop may be exactly what you need. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.